I've been experimenting a lot recently with flavoring cold brew coffee and I found a vanilla bean cold brew recipe online. So I wanted to show you how I've been making it. It's amazing. So check out this video. All right, so the vanilla bean cold brew recipe that I'm making is super easy. I am doing uh, two cups of coffee uh, in the toddy maker. So just two cups in there. And then I'm doing one full vanilla bean split lengthwise. So this is what a vanilla bean looks like. Uh, if you've never seen one before, it's kind of hard to see. It's just this long bean. It smells super awesome. It smells amazing. Uh, this one's not cut, so this is just one that I was going to show you, but it looks no different than the others, so whatever. Um, this is one that I split lengthwise, and you can see that it has these like little seeds inside. So when I make this, I actually split this uh, down the middle and I'm gonna cut this in, I think maybe two or three more slices. And then I'm just gonna put these beans right in the cold brew along with the water. I'm gonna do a four to one ratio. So I'll do eight cups of water because there's two cups of coffee in here. And then after I let it brew until um, through tomorrow, I'm going to actually scrape the seeds out and put them in the cold brew. So I'm gonna do that uh, tomorrow and I'll take another video when I do that. All right, so I just drained the coffee into the toddy, and then I pulled all the vanilla beans out and I just rinsed the coffee grounds off of them. And these are three that I haven't actually pulled the seeds out of yet. You can see the seeds are down there. And then these three, I actually stripped the seeds out and it kind of creates this like gooey substance, but those, uh, that is like where all the flavor is, is in those seeds that come out of the middle. So basically what I do is I'll take that and I'll put it into the toddy and mix it all around so that it dilutes it as much as I can and that'll create a really awesome vanilla flavor. So that's the, uh, that's the recipe I use and I've tried for a vanilla cold brew. It's kind of uh, a lot of work because you have to like strip out the seeds and everything but it tastes amazing and uh, give it a shot.